I'm going to sign him. I'm going to sign him. I'm going to sign him. Welcome back to Handful of Handsome. We are so happy to be here. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. There, that you hear is our live studio audience, right. which is it's pretty swelled the building. Yeah, it's packed in here right now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh. <laughs> you too, Felicia. Well, we have a great show. We're going to talk about a lot of things. Uh, homecoming. Yeah, it was a big week. Yes, it was. Week was. It was crazy. Um, I hope all you got out and joined in the homecoming events and stuff. Yeah, I and know. not just the weekend festivities. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I know I, I competed in like one of the things. I think I did the Human Tower. I was on yeah. the B team though, because I wasn't. Cut. I didn't make the cut for A. Yeah, I just beat Dwight like a, yeah. just a tad over the A team. So, you know, oh, we're still together though. We're still yeah. close in this. I'm just glad we're done with all that hectic campaigning now, because like it's it's fun. It's yeah. fun, but if there's a point where like you just get sick of seeing yeah. the candidates' faces like plastered yeah. all over campus, and it's hard pretending to like yeah. be that happy because you know, like, <laughs> yeah, you know, we're not like singing. Especially Bridgewater. at like six in the morning or whenever, like yeah. people get out to campaign, like yeah, no one's yeah. that cheery. Yeah, but yeah, I'm just pumped that we beat the statesmen. Right, right. I am <laughs> super pumped. I yeah. don't know about you guys, but <laughs> I hope you voted. Yeah. For royalty in the first place, maybe if you vote for Pete, that'd be even better. That would be even better. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pete Winslow. Well, we also have, addition to talking a little bit about homecoming, we have surface memories and what's happening from yeah. Dwight. So. Yeah. What is happening? Right. We're going to find out. Yeah. So we said, uh, like we said, Pete, Pete won. So we're just curious about how excited everybody is. Let's hear our live studio audience. How excited are you guys? <laughs> Yeah. Oh my goodness. Can we get some, I think we need some security over here. Yeah. Guys. It's getting rowdy. There's a mosh pit going. No. Jesus. Um, yeah. Yeah. Peter Yang Winslow. We're very proud of you. Yeah. So. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. We all worked really hard to make sure he secured that royalty. But I think, I think in the end, what won it was just he's such a great guy. I'm yeah. I'm glad to see him win it. Like, yeah. I know we all were. Yeah. You rap bastard. You know, it was. <laughs> it was a. Uh, it was a barn burner. Human pyramid, man. You're the laziest person I've ever met in my life. It was a barn burner, but we made it happen. And yeah. We, we couldn't do it we without the help of uh, advertising, which in oh, Mike yeah. Gerke and Blake Anderson had made some great posters. Yeah, they did. We even got let's some. Let's take a look at these. Let's, let's, let's look, at, let's these look at them. I think, personally, this one might this be one. my favorite. Yeah. Yeah, we can get a close-up of this. Uh, this is Mean Girls right here. For all y'all fans, Mean Girls. You I mean, you if can't. you didn't know any better, you would think this was a, a shot a from shot the actual of the, movie. Of yeah. the movie. You would yeah. think. Like, I, I can't even tell that's Photoshop. Right. Is that, is that the, yeah. Oh, what we, <laughs> we got here. Oh. Yeah, we got to fire. Oh, oh, Whoever oh, organized these is oh. getting fired. This is how we roll. When I actually recorded this. this <laughs> you know, when that I was happened. a good night, actually, yeah. if I recall. Yeah, that was, a, that was a lot of fun. That's the only night. Oh, wait. Oh. You know what? Let's just let's What's do myself a here? favor here. <laughs> yeah. Boom! Walk and roll with Pete Winslow right here. Yeah. Yeah. It's fantastic. This looks old, but I think it's what else we got. It's sexy as oh, this is. <laughs> get my get my what together? Yeah. I can't uh, even I can't even read. What what does this say? Um, this this is uh, Pete Winslow volunteers as tribute. Pete Winslow is tribute. Be Peter. Lord of Homecoming. Yeah, another excellent, excellent yeah. photo. <laughs> this is. Up, oh yeah, my way, goodness. Wow. See, my problem is. Directions. Is I'm watching the TV. Who knows how to do them? Wheeling and dealing. That's what Pete does. Here's another. <laughs> and uh, my personal favorite. 
is Hot I like this Hot Wheels one. <laughs> I like, there we go. Okay. I like this Hot Wheels one. Yeah. Take that a look is, at that. It's a great one. Because it's actually a pun too. So if you get it, if you know. If you get it. Well, another great thing that we did um, this was we had some oh, we yes. had a kind of a commercial. I don't know if you wanna Oh give no your, give your thoughts on this is uh this is Lethal Winslow right here. Yes. Yeah. Um, this is probably the best poster we have, honestly. This yeah. is, I'm actually hoping a full uh, movie comes out of this. Yeah, I mean, I think we just have to round up our budget. Yeah, yeah. it's got everything we love. It's got Pete, Justin Bieber, a dog, I think, is in there. This lady, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Right, yeah, what else could you want? Yeah. Yeah, well, we, we, you know, we might make a real movie on this, so we, uh, made, a, we made a little trailer. Yeah. Uh, check it out, guys. Take a look. Where is she? Ugh. Looks like you're all out of tread. Here, you'll need this. I'm getting too old for this. Everybody freeze! Looks like Christmas comes early. Oh, no! Ah! Looks like the wheel's on the other foot. I will fight for you. And I will vote for you. Why wouldn't you vote for me? He's a hero, he's a hunk, and he's a patriot. Man, it's just, it's so perfect. Yeah, that never gets old. Huh? Never gets old. I just have that playing. I just have that on repeat at home when I go to bed. Um, so yeah. Favorite favorite things about homecoming, I guess. Yeah. What was what was your favorite part about? My favorite thing, I guess, is just like all the like school spirit that goes on. Cause like I feel like homecoming week is really our only week we ever get any school spirit around yeah. here. Um, and it's just nice to see everyone like dressed up and like pumped for the game. Like everyone actually like we actually have a good attendance at our homecoming game. You know, yeah. and we actually played decent. Well, I shouldn't say we played decent, but it was it was a game. It was close. It was just, yeah. It wasn't you know, a complete record. Yeah, it's a heartbreaker, but and and I had my friends come up, so I got to show them like, you know, a how good time. yeah, a good time here at Eau Claire and like just yeah, wearing the homecoming pin around and wearing my TV yeah. ten swag out because oh, it looks heck, so cool. heck yeah. yeah, we got these great quarter zips on. Yeah, but for you like highlights? Oh, uh, all of it, <laughs> all of it. Yeah, uh, I campaigning. You know, yeah, I really like just getting to know everybody. Did you at get the orga at our organization? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, because we have a, like. Our, t our homecoming week is basically just a big bonding thing for everyone here at TV10. So it was really right. nice getting to know everyone at TV10. Yeah. Like I didn't know Luke before, and now I know. Yeah. Him. I, this is. And a, now I have a show with him. Well, <laughs> look at the possibilities. Just endless. Yeah. So that yeah, homecoming week. Yeah. I'm sad it's over, but I'm not. I yeah, it's exhausting. I will give you that. Yeah. Well, it's probably even more exhausting for <laughs> Phyllis, which is our little story of the week. Uh, yes. Phyllis is 106 years old, and she made it back to her first homecoming parade 86 years after she was graduated. She graduated, wow. she started in 1926, and on October 9th through the 10th, that is when the first homecoming ever, ever started. Ever yeah, happened. ever. First that there, is there crazy. She was with Chancellor Jim. That is crazy. Right, it, it was just a teacher's college back then. That's what she said. Uh, that's all they had. They didn't offer any more than that. That's what Phil said. Yeah. And <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. Words. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine. She must be blown away now yeah. by just like how crazy and how much campus has changed. Like, yeah, definitely. I mean, I thought that this was like a like a cool campus when I first came here, my freshman yeah. year. And now we have like two new buildings. Right. Much, you know. It, even in the last five years, a lot has changed. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Speaking of crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking Whoa. of crazy. That's crazy facts here too. Yeah. You should read off. Well, you know what? <laughs> I'll start her out then. All right. Whoa! 
Um, back then? They just had Schofield Hall. That was it. It started in 1919. Schofield. I believe that's the year when they first started. Yeah. Um, that's, yeah. They just had, that was it. Oldest building on campus. Yeah, yeah it's, I like it. It's a good building. I just feel like an old person when I walk in that building. Yeah, it's you know, just, I don't yeah. really ever, can't say the same, but. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Um, yeah, she was born in Osseo on March 31st, 1909. And Phyllis was thrilled to learn that she would be able to attend college for only $14 in tuition per Ooh. semester. That's kind of pricey. Yeah. I'm just, a bit much. I'm just, bit much. Even back then, that's like, that's a lot. Yeah. I mean, now you might be able to get like a coffee in Davies. For right. Like, for 14 bucks. For that's, <laughs> if you get stuff on Declining, it's like yeah. eight bucks for like a candy bar. And like, <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. It's crazy now. But we should, yeah. I should bring this up next time I go to pay my, my Yeah. Seriously. Uh -huh. Let's go back to the old days. Well, we had a lot of great footage from the week. Um, we got a couple of short clips here. They're actually yeah. taken uh, on somebody's phone. So the first one is me diving for a, uh, the water balloon. And I, you know what, I didn't quite come up with it. This is my <laughs> metaphor for my life. Just check it oh, out. Oh, true. OK. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> oh, oh Just, God. Oh, was, ah. You know, I actually aggravated something in my groin. <gasps> really? Diving for that. I'm not even kidding you. Yeah, I believe. Yeah, it looks like you went full body force. I, I go into all that. out like, for that. How can you not? Like, wow, the dedication here at T10 for our sports. Yeah. Yeah, we got, well, we have another video. Um, it's, you know what? We'll kind of let you watch it for yourself, but yeah. I'm just getting pushed in a cart by our own royalty, P. Winslow. And we'll just, we might watch it a few times to check yeah. it out. Yeah, we'll roll it. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you can just see, you can just see this going bad again. Like, let's watch it again. You can just see the the terrible. Like everything's going good. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. And then it cuts <laughs> off just before I slam. <laughs> 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 oh, this is <laughs> this is why there's never enough carts around moving day because you are People probably are, taking them to roll around campus. In. That'd be. For your own going down the hill on that? Yeah. Okay, no. <laughs> Tune in next week. <laughs> <Dude>. <laughs> Luke takes on the hill and a moving bin. Well, <laughs> yeah. um, we're going to go to commercial, but we will be back with the surface members. Yeah. Please stick, stick around. Con los Hi folks, I'm Garth Brooks, and I know there's a lot of talk about high taxes and the high cost of health care today. But did you know there's something very simple that you can do to help? And that's just be a safe driver. One, always wear your safety belt. And two, never drink and drive. Traffic accidents alone last year in the United States cost all of us over $100 billion. And we all share that cost. So do your part. Get involved. Highway safety is everybody's business. Oh, you know me. I was watching TV 10 all night. Really? So was I. Yeah, well, let's go do it again. OK. Welcome back. It's Guys, come on. Welcome back, yeah. It really makes a show. Yeah. Well, before we get to uh, what's happening, um, some people look at us and they, they think we're deep thinkers, but we're actually really shallow. <laughs> so we have really some surface shallow. memories here. Uh, take a look. As 
I drove my car earlier today, I saw another car. The other car was like my car, in as many ways as it was different. It was like seeing the whole universe reflected in gasoline. I breathe in the fumes of God and feel my soul get better mileage. The other car that was not my car was listening to terrible tunes in my head. Tunes that were full of bad juju and banjos. This was a car that was not my car, but the driver had taste that would kill the hearts of stars, in my mind at least. Reality is a road trip, all useless maps, endless directions, and full of too many potty breaks. We are the cars that travel down the highway of life. We are all one car, and it is a Mitsubishi. Hungry, I shall allow a chip that I found in between my seats to pass into my digestion. It tastes like ass. The ass of life. That was yeah. that was good. I always I always love those. Um, so now we're gonna move on to what's happening. Ooh. Everyone's favorite segment of the show. Um, yeah. So today I did a little digging around, a little research. Um, you know, trying to find a nice, cool, free app for everyone. Um, and I found this cool little ditty called uh, Granny Smith. <coughs> now it's 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 a little mobile game. Um, I don't know if you can get like a close up on this at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so basically, Real close up, uh, so basically, um, you're this hey. grandma, and you're trying to get this, these apples from this kid that like stole them from you. <laughs> and yeah, you're on rollerblades, so it's pretty, it's pretty awesome. Kids are rascals, aren't they? Yeah, and then you have to like, you have to jump. Oh, yeah, we, got, we landed a flip there. Ooh. Yeah, I've this? gotten pretty good at it. Um, Oh, oh God, okay, we almost fell there. Yeah, uh, it, it gets kind of insane. Like, oh Jesus. Oh. <laughs> supposed to land on my feet. <laughs> oh, but you didn't. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, there's a cane too, I think, like in the later parts of it. I'm just doing backflips for show now. Really agile. Maybe this is actually. Yeah. You're trying to bring games into our show? Yeah, like well, I mean, oh, God, okay. I'm just going to move on to the next level, honestly, because I, I can't. Yeah. I, I'm really bad, so I just, like, skip. I think you can pay to, like, skip ahead if you want, but... <laughs> oh, right. Now, now I have a cane. I don't know if you can... Oh, there we go. It's really off. There we go. There we go. Oh, ooh, <laughs> get that rascal. <laughs> yeah. Oh, get him! <laughs> get back here get back with my app. <laughs> what do you... Did you get him or what? What is going on? Um, you're just supposed to beat him to it. Like, oh, okay. If he like, gets away, then I thought you beat him. Yeah, this can, this cane's pretty you awesome. Just kill um, old time. Normally, I would say don't try this at home, but honestly, if you can, go for it. Yeah. Oh, okay, now we're just smashing buildings. Don't See, you just hate when your grandma does that? Yeah. <laughs> so that oh god yeah so that's um that's Granny Smith um. It's free. There, you can't get a paid version for like an extra dollar. Yeah, a little taste of home screen. Yeah, a little, little taste of home screen. <laughs> I love that. Uh, how does it feel to have uh, one year under your belt? Of home screen? Uh, yeah. It feels pretty good. It's yeah. weird, though, I'm honestly. surprised, but yeah. Yeah. And you're, you'll be, when was the first? I would, we've already had one year, yeah. technically. But technically, you will have been on air for a year this. Following semester. This following semester. Wow. Awesome. Getting old. Yeah. <laughs> it really is. Um, we're going to head to commercial, Yeah. but when we come back, we have some musical talent, because we're not... Yeah! Woo! Um, yeah, um, yeah, I'm excited for it, and you should be too, so we'll be right back with some awesome musical talent. Jeez. 
was so far from campus. How can I get back? I can call the res van. Hi, can I get a ride from Bollinger back to campus? Thanks. Need a ride? Call the Resident Escort Shuttle Service. All you have to do is call 715-559-5468. The shuttle operates from 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. Monday through Thursday, and from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. and 6 p.m. to 1 a.m. Saturday and Sunday. The shuttle will pick up and drop off at any location on campus, and also at off-campus locations such as the Plaza Hotel, America's Best Value Inn, and the Bollinger Lot. The resident escort shuttle service. Your free ride is just a phone call away. Zombie Craig, Zombie Craig, everyone likes Zombie Craig. Guys, nobody better lay a finger on my Butterfinger. Craig. Everyone likes Zombie Craig. Hey, Craig, can you give me a hand? Craig, you're such an asshole. Everyone likes on me, Craig. Hey, Craig, could you keep an eye on this? Wait, never mind. What? You think I'm incompetent or something? Zombie Craig, Zombie Craig, everyone likes Zombie Craig. Welcome back. We, we got Kayla and Schumacher right here. Woo. We don't have any talent at this point. <laughs> Music or anything else. So, um, Kayla, when did you start playing the ukulele? Yeah. Um, like three years ago. Yeah, three years ago. And why, what brought you to playing the ukulele? Um, I was at like my cousin's house and her like best friend was playing ukulele and we were all singing around campfire and like jamming out and I was like, I can sing, I want to do that and I already played guitar so I was like, Pfft. it's easier. Yeah. Like yeah. <coughs> so ukulele is a lot easier than guitar. I mean, on some levels, it just like depends. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> you, are there are there names of the songs you're gonna play for us today? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna be playing. Um, Sunday morning by Maroon 5, awesome. and then I'm going to play I Can't Help Falling in Love with You by Elvis. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Awesome. You sound amazing. Well, Ooh. we're going to back away so you don't yeah. have to look at our ugly faces so all the time. So, take it away. Okay, get out of here. <laughs> okay.
was great. That was really impressive. Thank you. Awesome. Thanks for playing. Yeah. Thanks for we, having me. <laughs> I'm now I'm down. I got <laughs> now we're all on the same level. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really, really great job. Thanks. Um, you have an awesome voice. Thank you. Um, so but that's about all we have for the today. Yeah. Tonight, technically. Come back <laughs> next Wednesday at 6.30 for and more entertainment. Also watch on Thursday to watch me on VNN. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Stay handsome. <laughs>